It's it's really not that big of a deal. I think. Oh my god, the best clean ever. Holy crap, easy. Okay. How's it going guys? My name is Omicron and welcome back to another video. And basically what I wanted to talk about in this video is should you jitter click? Why or why not? And is jitter clicking going to help you more? than just, you know, regular clicking at around 6 to 7 FPS or a CPS, you know, stuff like that. That's basically what I wanted to cover in this video. The reason I've been thinking about this a little bit is just because uh, I've been looking at a bunch of other YouTubers' playstyles because, you know, well, I guess me personally, you know, I'm always always trying to get to that next level of Minecraft PvP or whatever, or whatever you want to call it. I don't know. People have their own excuses, but I yeah, can't tell if you're playing or just streaming. Okay, well, I am actually recording, so good job. Life is unfair. You missed both of them. Anyway, no, I'm kidding. Uh, but, yeah. Um... What was I going to say? Yeah, I've been looking at, like, other YouTubers' playstyles. I think, you know, for me, at least, it, it's kind of interesting just because, you know... The way that other people PvP, if you can inter if you can like combine the good things about other people's PvP playstyles together, you're gonna be a really good PvP overall. Like you know, if you look at a lot of other people, like they've just gotten good at like watching other YouTubers and stuff like that, which I think is I think is pretty cool. So it's a good it's good it's an interesting idea to uh, analyze whether jitter clicking is actually useful or not, or should you know should, is it more helpful to you or you know. That's basically what I mean. Anywho, so let's go over a couple examples. Like, say, take for instance, uh, like Technoblade, for instance. He obviously does not jitter click. He, he has like 7 CPS. He does what I do, which is basically you just, you don't put your hand in any form of position. You just click. That's that's all you do. <laughs> you don't, because I know with jitter, with jitter clicking, essentially what you're doing is you're trying to tense up the muscle so it vibrates like if you if you tense any muscle you'll start shivering and that's essentially what you're doing with jitter clicking the thing about jitter clicking though is that you know a lot of people say you know it has health risks safety issues you know stuff like that i that's not what i'm going to be covering in this video just mainly because i don't honestly think it's going to be that big of a deal because the way you know there's already a lot of problems with how we you know use our use our uh, keyboard and mouse and stuff like that like that'll hurt our wrists and stuff like that and there are alterations that you can use to use them but they haven't really been developed that much and the reason I'm bringing this up is because you know if there are people out there that are like oh jitter clicking causes arthritis like see right now my, my CPS counter in the bottom right of the screen is actually really inaccurate because it only caps at like 8 CPS I, I don't actually know why it's, it's a keystrokes on a CPS counter but you know, what, what do you expect um because of that um because of the jitter clicking and stuff like you know, I don't. It probably is not. It probably is going to actually cause some long-term damage. I suppose if you do it for too much. But like, I honestly don't feel like it's that big of a deal. Like, I know some people. There's like some pain afterwards, but you know, otherwise you're just like tensing a muscle, so shouldn't be that bad. Anyway, and so that's that's why I'm not covering um, the entire like health safety risk aspect of of jitter clicking, because I honestly don't think it's like you know that big of a deal. So rip. Oh, that guy's gonna burn alive. What? <laughs> wow. Okay. This man needs to die a horrible, painful death. You wanna, you wanna bow me? You wanna bow me, sir? Oh, you trying to get a combo on me? Trying to get a combo on me? Oh, 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 dang! Oh, he's actually getting a combo on me. <laughs> Doesn't matter. I just cheered. Okay. Anyway. How? I had you. She. Oh. 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 Oh, okay, let's get into another. Okay, I should actually probably, like, you know, talk about my video idea because, yeah, I'm getting really, really off topic. So, yeah, okay, anyway. So, health and safety risks aside, um, you know, I would say jitter clicking is, it's, it's become kind of meta in the Minecraft community. Like, you know, you don't know how to jitter click? Well, you're just bad at video games, but, yeah, not, not really. But, you know, is jitter clicking better? And I would actually say, you know, jitter clicking is not as good as it was, say, like, last one. Okay, so we can be in your vid. You're welcome. I... Oh, have people found out I'm recording a vid? Oh, God. Uh, oh, 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 why? I'm getting distracted. Okay, anyway. Yes, so... <laughs> why does this always happen? It happened last video, I'm pretty sure, as well. I'm not, I don't remember. Right, that, was, that was a while ago. Okay, anyway. See, this is what I mean. Is I, I'm getting distracted. And I can't talk about my video. So, yes, I would actually say jitter clicking, it's not as good as it would have been, like, in 2016 and 2017. Let me explain. So, 2016, 2017... Big years for like you know 
learning how to jitter click. People are like, you know, I gotta get on this jitter clicking tread, man. Clicking faster, it'll totally help me. And stuff like that, you know? How, how can I take my CPS to the next level? Like, oh, you might, you might have 12 CPS, but that doesn't match my 14 CPS, which means I will totally beat you in a 1v1. Get good, mate. Anyway. So yeah, they were overall. I would say they're 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 big years. Oh my God, why? Okay, uh, they're they were big years of jitter clicking. You know, people wanted to know how to jitter click and stuff like that. But the thing about <laughs> those years as well is that I feel like a lot of people's aim were really bad, and that's the thing about jitter clicking. It, it doesn't it doesn't really allow for aim that well. Like you you can't aim that well while you're jitter clicking. That's the thing. So. I mean, I, that's just at least my experience. I know you can get used to it and stuff like that, but is it really better than normal clicking? Does having that extra, like, 5 CPS really assist you that much? That's that's the thing, and I would honestly say it really doesn't that much. I mean, if you're playing combo, I can understand, but... I, I Okay, well, first of all, I don't play combo. <laughs> Let me just get that out of the way. Um, but, you know, like, I guess with combo, it would obviously help because, you know, that's where there's no, like, maximum, like, delay, hit delay, I suppose you could say. Like, you know, if I started clicking really fast on someone, it's only going to hit them, like, at a certain speed. And jitter clicking, it, it'll maybe make up for that speed, like, a tiny bit. It's, like, it's it's really not that big of a deal. Oh, my God, the best clean ever. Holy crap. Easy. Okay, yeah, you can easy me all you want. I'm not going to I'm not gonna say anything after that. That was the biggest clean I have ever performed. Wow, okay. <laughs> An interesting, interesting. We will find you. I swear, what is going on in my DMs? I have no idea. You guys need to save me. I'm playing on the same map. I didn't choose this. I go random map every time. Okay, anyway. <laughs> wow, I, I don't even know. So yes, when you have an aim on, on your on someone, if it's a very good aim, I feel like, you know, jitter clicking versus regular clicking, it's not gonna matter. You're gonna get around the same hit speed. Now, I can understand where jitter clicking might help, like if you're going up against someone that has like the exact same PvP level as you and the only difference is that they're jitter clicking, I would say that that would actually help because with hit registration and stuff like that, the more clicks you're putting in on a person, the more hits are, you know, are being, you know, it's like the game is essentially saying, yeah, uh, say to, like, the server, hey, this person is getting a ton of hits, like, here, here's all these hits, and the server is essentially only registering, like, a certain amount of hits per second, but sometimes the server hits don't register, and so when the hits aren't registering that well, that's, yes, that is probably when, when, uh, you know, jitter clicking will help, and a lot of the time it's very minimal and people don't really notice it, but sometimes, and, you know, that's essentially where jitter clicking would pretty much shine, because, it went against someone who's clicking slightly sl not as fast as you that's you know it's it's going to s make a slight difference and that slight difference is what's probably going to win you the fight but that's assuming that that person you're going up against is the same level of pvp skill as you and most people don't have perfect game i've i've seen i've seen montages and stuff like that there's unless they're using aim assist i have not seen a single case of where you know, some some person is aiming so incredibly well that, you know, it looks like they're uh, using uh, aimbot. Like, people that are using aimbot, it's very obvious that they're using aimbot. So, we haven't really reached that level where, you know, you know, Minecraft aim has become so good. Which is why I would say that, you know, you should focus on your aim more than focusing on your jitter clicking. Because jitter click, I understand why in 2016 and 2017 jitter clicking was such a big deal. Because people can... They could aim, but they couldn't aim that well, and so what they would do is they would jitter click super fast, and then if your if your cursor is going like this across this, if your crosshair is going across the screen like this, eventually, like you know, you might be crossing over the person, and because you're jitter clicking, there's more clicks that are registering, and your hit will register. Like for instance, if I'm clicking at this fast, and I, there's a player like in the middle of my screen, for instance, I'm I might click past them, whereas if I'm jitter clicking, I'm clicking faster, so therefore. There's less mistakes that can be made, and I, I, I might be zoop, my my crosshair might be going across them, and there's a higher chance that my click will register on them. If that kind of makes sense, it it's a little hard to explain from my I think this is my perspective from it. I I don't I don't own servers or anything, and I don't know what how hack clients work and stuff like that. And I I know a lot of people that you know that use hack clients and that you know make hack clients or investigate hack clients. What on earth are oh my god. Why? These people are ruining my video? Not really, actually. I don't honestly care, but... Uh, okay. Well, this is interesting. This is interesting. I heard some big damage. There he is! Hello there, friend. You have kind of amount of gear. I have full time in them. <laughs> anyway, so yes. Uh, that That's basically the bulk of what I wanted to explain with that, at least. And uh, the other thing with jitter clicking, you know, it's like... That, uh, the thing about the aim thing is that, you know, it's very hard to get really good aim while you're jitter clicking. It's... 
you have less grip on the mouse. That's why I like the method that uh, that I use for clicking. You know, it's it's a little bit more accurate if you get what I mean. Okay, sorry, I was scratching, scratching my neck. Okay, it's a little bit more you know accurate. It's a little easier to control the mouse. I have full I have full control. I have all the power. You know. So that's that's at least my take on it. This, unless they're unless you're really good at aiming while you're jitter clicking, which is a very very valuable aspect as you use. However, I would say you should probably focus on your aim more than your jitter clicking. That's at least my take on it. Okay, goodbye. Have a very nice time. He's coming to spawn. Oh my god, I have no idea what's going on. Okay, this man is being annoying. I'm just gonna go. Yeah, I think he took all the mid loot actually. That's probably what happened. He was. He's so cool, man. He's so cool. Okay, anyway. Uh, yeah, that's basically the bulk of my argument. Overall, I, I would say jitter clicking, it's not actually that good as people would make it out to be. Uh, if you want to jitter click, go for it. Just make sure, you know, I would I would work on aim more than trying to get your CPS up. And that's just because the, the Minecraft, the blocky world of PvP that we live in, it's, it's more based around aim and skill than it is based around, you know, soul jitter clicking, you know, j jitter clicking abilities and stuff like that. So I, I've I've looked at several YouTubers where that's the case. You know, I've I've done I've done some research. Although I honestly think doing too much research on a Minecraft topic does someone something to a person. So that's why. Um, yeah. Anyway, hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video. At least I just want to kill this last person. I've I've basically made the bulk of my argument. I don't know where this man is. This is bothering me. What is my life? Okay, let's go back to man. <laughs> what is this person doing? I don't know, man. I don't know. Okay, let's go back to, like, the actual middle. Are you gonna, like, fight me, dude? Oh, he's gonna fight me. Dang! Oh, dang! Gotta try hard, man! Oh, dang! Okay. Well, rest in peace. <laughs> uh, yeah, so... Uh, that's, that's, uh, that's... Oh, nice hack. Dude, we've gotten how many accusations? Like, uh, JK. Okay, never mind. <laughs> I don't I can't even tell anymore. I can't even tell when people are joking or not. Okay. Anyway, so what should you do? Should you jitter click? Should you work on your aim? I would say, you know, jitter clicking and regular clicking, they're they're kind of two different PvP styles, so therefore jitter clicking or learning how to aim while normal clicking isn't gonna help you while jitter clicking. I will however say that it's probably a little easier to do whatever you've been doing, so don't make a drastic switch. So if you've been normal clicking this entire time, you know, keep it a normal clicking, just improve your aim. And if you've been jitter clicking this entire time you know improve improve your a aim while jitter clicking you know that's essentially that's essentially what you should probably do but if you're like if you're not really good at normal clicking or you know you're not really good at jitter clicking in terms of both for aim like you would say you'd probably do as well jitter clicking as you are normal clicking then yeah it might be a good idea to see what works best for you you know try both of them try try working on your aim for a little bit for both of them and see which one you like more you know that's it's entire entirely personal preference you know i'm not i'm not like some communist leader that's going to you know barge down your door and threaten you with guns and violence if if you don't click this certain way but yeah <laughs> anyway so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video i'm gonna see if i can get more uploads in i have Bandcamp and i have school so rip but yeah hopefully you guys enjoyed and i'll see you guys next video